Welcome to the IC3D training video, Enhanced Flexibles, creating realistic creases, crumples, and dents in flexible bags. When you are finished creating your flexible bag and have added your artwork, materials, and finishing effects, you can add further realism to your bag by adding creases, bumps, crumples, or dents using the new Physics Simulation feature. Select your bag in the scene and click on the Point Editor icon from within the Object Editor window. This will open the Point Editor control window. You will see a warning message pop up on the screen. Just click Yes. First, you will want to lock the points that make up the seals of your bag so that they remain in their current position. This will allow you to add physical properties to the rest of the bag. Click and drag over the points that represent the top and bottom seals of your bag. To select multiple points, hold down the Shift key on your keyboard while clicking and dragging. Once all the required points are selected, click the Lock Constraint Points button. The Add Constraints window will appear. Make sure that the All Selected Points option is selected and click Apply. Click the Apply Physics Constraints button. You will see a warning message pop up on the screen. Just click Yes. IC3D will then calculate and apply a physical mesh to your 3D model. On the right-hand side of the panel, scroll down and select the Ignore Backfaces option. This will allow you to individually select and manipulate the points that make up the front and back sides of your model. You can rotate the mesh by holding down the control key on the keyboard while clicking and dragging. You can reduce the size of the point editor window to allow you to see your 3D model in the scene behind it. Any amendments that you make to your model's mesh in the point editor will be seen in real time on your 3D model. Selecting a number of points within the model's mesh allows you to push, pull, and drag them in any direction. Physics simulation calculates the effect that dragging these points has on the surrounding area, simulating the effect that performing this same action would have on a bag in reality. You can move the points by pushing or pulling them on their X, Y, or Z axis. Once you are happy with the result, you can turn off Physics Simulation by again clicking on the Apply Physics Constraints button. Scroll down the right-hand side of the control panel and turn off the Ignore Backfaces option. You can now manipulate your bag further by selecting points and pushing or pulling them in any direction without physics effects being applied allowing you to curve, bend, and crease your bag seals for further realism. Once you are happy with your new bag, click the Save to Model button and open the Raise Renderer Preview window to see what your final high-res image will look like. This completes the IC3D training video, Enhanced Flexibles, creating realistic creases, crumples, and dents in flexible bags.